Hi everyone, it's Irene and I have a little project I'd like to share with you today. Um, I was trying to um, alter clothespins. Found out that not all clothespins are alike, obviously. Some are skinny and short, some are wider and taller, darker, and they're hardware on them. Some of them are super tight, some of them come up super loose, and some of them are just, you know, need a little work and they come out quite easy if you just pull and twist and it works out pretty good. So I started to decorate and my clothespins were coming apart. As you see, I have quite a few here that were just not working out for me. And I had all these pieces left over. So I just want to show you what I did with these little pieces. I took um, the jar I have on my desk filled with all kinds of bits and pieces from projects that I've done already. And this is getting quite full so I thought I better get to the jar and use it up. I also had some of my favorite stickles, the diamond version, and um, before I throw these away, you know, after you keep them upside down and you knock all you can into the tip, believe it or not, if you cut it open, there's still a lot to be used here. So I use my Q-tip and I'll show you what I'm able to do with that. And I also, in my project, use this little tape that I got from Hobby Lobby. It was just 99 cents, but you get quite a bit on here. And um, let's see if it says how much. Yeah, it's six feet for 99 cents. Really cute. So let me just show you what I did altering this little metal piece and all the stickles that I used by cutting open the bottle. I was able to do five of these. And it's just a piece of muslin a piece of that tape, my enamel dot that I made, a sentiment, some leftover ribbon, and I'm able to either put a seam binding to the top, make it like a little dangle from a junk journal or card or however. You can also put a paper clip through there and that works out really well and you can just slide your paper clip and have it hanging off your paper clip. And I've been doing that in just a minute. Let me go get that real quick. I wanted to show you that. This is going to be a big paper clip, but you can do it. And this is the way I was going to do it right here. You just slide it on, and you're able to go ahead and alter that paper clip and hang off of there. So um, you can put beads on here and so on and so forth and make it pretty. Or you can put a little chain or thread. So that's this one. And here's another one. Really cute. And here's that one, just bits and pieces from that jar. Still able to use all that stickles from cutting open that jar. And like I said, I'm going to be using chain, seam binding, or a paper clip to make these little charms to hang off of my junk journals or cards and so on. But to uh, have your hand at looking at some of these findings from your clothespins and use them up in a different way. And I think I have a project I thought of just the other day of what I can do with these pieces here. And um, anyway, so here's a view of all the things you can do. Try your hand at it. Show me what you come up with. But these were a lot of fun to use up scraps off the desk. All right, everyone. Thanks so much for stopping by. Hope everyone's having a great day. Take good care. Bye-bye.